لا شنو شنو سيريس هي كان هاندل ات هي كان هاندل ات so i hope you uh, like that little intro piece that was completely my hands that is a, uh, something that i came up with that he's going to teach them this is jarell he's going to be my stunt hands for my episode jarell is a good friend of mine two years ago on my birthday yeah yeah two years we ago. went and got tattoos yeah. together so we both have yeah. potatoes on our butts <laughs> russet potatoes while we were hanging out when they, he showed me this card vanishing to me it looked really cool and i said hey man I, I want I want to rob that from you. I want to steal it. So this is Xavier's card vanish, taught by Jarrell, and you should go follow him on his his uh, Instagram. Like I said, Jarrell's a good friend of mine. He's he's got some dope moves. We're also going to be putting out a ring vanish thing that he does that <clears throat> blew my mind. So this is his way of saying thanks for future buying that. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for future value <laughs> that. This is your pre-order. <laughs> you pre-order by watching this. Anyway, Jarrell is a good friend of mine. He's got some dope moves and we're actually working on a project where he's going to be doing some, some ring stuff. So Garrett Thomas is getting shut down soon because Jarrell is on the way. Just show him how to do the shit, man. Just, right, I'm going to so do, do a close-up and you're going to show him. So we'll just cut to the awesome shit right now. So. All right, so hey guys, um, so let's get into the tutorial. Um, not quite sure what to call it yet, but it's something I was messing around with. Um, wanted to get away from the conventional vanish of holding a card this way or holding it, getting it ready for back clip or such. I wanted to create a vanish that I can do not only the long way, but so that the spectator can't follow it, go where it's going. So I'll show you right now. So the card completely disappears, and you can completely bring the card back however you want. Um, the vanish is pretty much you take the middle finger and the pointer finger, and you're just gonna use the middle finger to pull the card all the way in until the bottom of the card pivots into about cutting the hand in half. So you're gonna use the middle finger at this point, along, of course, with the cover of this hand. You're gonna pull that card in and force it into the Tenkai. It's gonna feel like it wants to jump off of the thumb, but you know, a little tack on your hands, and you should be able to. You should be able to like hold it there. But if uh, your hands really dry, this may happen where it flies out. But you work on it, you'll find the right temperature and environment, just like any other trick. Yeah, that's pretty much it. So now the timing of when to start this action all depends on this hand. So you want to come up in a wiping action and right when your finger hits the corner you want to start the vanishing process. So this hand, if you look here, as it waves this way you start the process. This hand, the pointer finger, is going to cover that until it's forced into here when you pull away. So there you go. So basically, if you've done a retention vanish, it's kind of similar to a retention vanish with a coin, except uh, it's a longitudinal palm. So longitudinal palm is something that not many people use. It's kind of like a tenkai. A tenkai is the longitudinal way, but longitudinal palm is the other way. I think I just discovered paradox. <laughs> you know, there's not many things that use a longitudinal palm. I think the only things that I've seen that use it is stuff from like by forces unseen and things like a swivel kick out and things like that. It's, there you go, something new with a longitudinal palm that you could do that makes you get all the ladies. I've done this twice and let me tell you something, it works. I now have all four of the ladies. Good job. <laughs> Thank you. <man. laughs> go, go give my boy Jarrell a subscribe if you like the tutorial. Get, get, you know, think about smashing that like button, the thumbs up side, the thumbs down side doesn't do it. Don't, don't do that. It doesn't work. Just do the thumbs up side and tell me what you think about it and, and some uses that you could come up with using this move. Put that in the comments below and thank you. Thank you. Give this guy a, a follow on his Instagrams that I put up in the pictures somewhere around here. 
and in the descriptions. It's a cool advantage, man. Like I, I can't, I definitely can't do it yet, but it's beautiful to see him do it when he does it. So as always, thank you for stopping by. Give my boy Jarrell a shout out on his Instagrams and say, hey, you have a long middle toe. And that's how he'll know that you came from this channel. <laughs> Anyway, thank you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next vidadio. Vida